Hey, what's going on guys? DJ has here. Got another achievement tutorial for you guys. This is when the revolution comes and this is on solo on a buried map of Call of Duty Zombies. And uh, first and foremost, I want to show you guys that this is able to be done without the ray gun. I've seen a lot of videos saying ray gun, ray gun. You don't have to have a ray gun. Uh, I'm using the pack-a-punched um, Mustang and Sally, but I'm sure you could probably shoot it with a grenade. It just crumbles like uh, like it would with an explosive. So that's first. Uh, I did this one, uh, the first one, but really you're supposed to do the other one first um, to make this work. But anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and work my way back around and show you guys the other fountain. So the, basically there's just two fountains you have to, to uh, destroy. And this one you have to use the beer or the alcohol or whatever, the booze for the, uh, the giant guy to knock over. He knocks over the fountain. And it doesn't seem like it would trigger anything. I don't have any sound on right now, so I don't know if it actually triggers anything. Uh, but uh, but once he ends up knocking that one over, then if you go back to the other one that I already was at, it will show you that it, it basically creates like a, a warp tunnel. Um, so I'm going back to the other one right now. And this, this achievement was actually pretty easy to get. I'm only around three and I was able to do this. But uh, I also have a, a, a trick to be able to, to get lots and lots of points by round one. If you guys haven't seen my channel, go check it out. But, uh, but basically, uh, check the, the playlist. And there was another achievement to get the pack-a-punched uh, guns done early. And that's the one that I ended up doing. It was Awaken the Gazebo. Uh, if you want to check out that one, because I, I got my pack of punch guns by round one, which is just crazy. Anyway, so I'm going back here and check this out. Now it's glowing. Didn't have to do anything else. I uh, don't need any uh, nav card table parts or anything like that. And um, that's pretty much it, man. You just got to jump in and uh, it warps you back to the beginning area where you were, but in the bottom half where you were not able to access before. And right there it says when the revolution comes and I just uh, unlocked that achievement. So hopefully you guys found this uh, little uh, tip and trick video helpful. If you guys did and uh, and you were able to get the achievement, uh, leave a comment. Let me know it helped you or uh, give the video a thumbs up. But I have a ton more videos to come, guys. This is just uh, the beginning, unfortunately, for myself and my wife. Where I'm a little bit tired uh, from, from doing so many videos. But having a lot of fun playing the map and just trying to explore and do everything new. So uh, I will catch you guys later. Peace.